market. However, as a family, we Tears flowed freely as family and friends bid farewell to two-year-old Wilson Karungaru, who met his death following an attack by six dogs that strayed from a neighbor's compound. Mourners, including Nyeri Governor Waomegakuru, lamented that the incident was an act of negligence calling for justice. And, and everybody in the country has really been touched by this. The gentleman told me, uh, um, uh, from, from Gatundu, from that side, he said his, his wife, so this and she also broke down to cry. My wife in the same situation. So it's, it's a matter that has truly, truly touched us. Wale mbuwa siju kama mba waona ni wakubwa kabisa. Lakini dada Margaret alipambana na hao. The mother was not able to move because you understand. Lakini ye alingangana, akajaribu kupigana na wale mbuwa, karibu wa haribu na lakini I want to thank you Margaret. As everything goes on, whatever the matter, you did your best as a human being and as a mother. The late Wilson was attacked while playing outside his grandmother's house and died while receiving treatment at the Old Span Hospital. And we must say it here, it's wrong. Kwa luga zote, na tunafuraha kwamba kama serikali, tayari tumechukua hatua, mbu wa wameuawa, aliefanya makosa, tayari amepelekwa kotini, na tunangojea serikali, Na, ma, na koti na kila kitu sheria ichukue mkono wake because justice must be given to the little boy and to the family the dogs were also killed on Wednesday following an agreement between Gashagwa's family and their owner. The owner of the dogs and their handler were arrested and charged with negligence before being released on bond of 100,000 shillings. Trial for their case is expected to start in October. Brenda Kiprono reporting for Channel 1 News Hour.